All right, well, a good afternoon, everyone. It's Tony here from the Finish the Race Car Show at Calvary Temple in Sterling. I'm here with Jeff, the owner of this fantastic 2013 VW GTI. Jeff, thanks for joining us today. Thank you for having me. Yep. Yeah, it's, it's great to have you out today. You have such a unique vehicle. Tell me, uh, did you get it at its original stock vehicle, or how long have you had it? So when I bought the vehicle, um, it was about, I've had it about four years now. Uh, when I originally bought it, it had some lowering springs on it and a couple little things that were painted. Other than that, it was bone stock. Excellent. Um, and since then, I've done uh, everything that's been done to the car, I did myself. Wow. Uh, it's got a wide body, custom made wide body that I did myself. Uh, I tried to do it where it accented the car features sure. instead of heavily changed the overall look of the car. Um, it's got 10 inch wide wheels on the front, 11 and a half in the rear, uh, BBS RS's stepped up to 18 uh, with 17 inch uh, what they call OEM faces. Um, and then as far as the motor goes and stuff like that, it's a, what they would call a full bolt on. So anything that can be bought for and bolted on has been done. Okay. It's a stage two high boost uh, tune on it with a DSG tune. Um, and it's probably somewhere around 250 horsepower, maybe a little bit more, maybe a little bit less, but it's enough for me. For sure. Um, and then so all around, it's got airlift, um, three, uh, 3P air management. Uh, and the what I feel like is the big feature of the car um, is the trunk setup that I did. Uh, it's got a, a custom painted air tank that matches the, the black and gold um, finish on the wheels, the Excellent. black and gold finish on the, the engine stuff, the black and gold finish on the, the roof box. And then it's got all aluminum hard lines that are all bent and go in between and in and out of holes and all that. And then um, what I tried to do to st stand away from everybody is the little Louis Vuitton features all over yeah, the car. Yeah, tell me about that. I thought that was really unique. So if you look on the trunk setup, uh, the, it's, a, it's a double tier that you'll see, and it's got Louis Vuitton on the wood, then it's got a tier, and then an insert of Louis Vuitton okay. as well. And the P3 management in the center of it, which is kind of a focal point, has got a Louis Vuitton faceplate on it. And then I've gone through and I've done my door panels in Louis Vuitton. Love it. The pull straps on the racing harnesses are done in Louis Vuitton. Of course, the shifter boot. And then on the door pillars, uh, I just did a little bit of accent of Louis Vuitton to kind of tie it all in together. It's fantastic. Was there any specific reason why you chose the black and gold theme or? You know, I, I really like gold. Um, and, uh, you know, that's, just that's really amazing. about it. I mean, I, I, love I, it. I love the color gold and uh, the car was already a great color that would okay, accent perfect. the gold. And so I just I just went with that theme. You, you've done a phenomenal job with it, it, and we can't thank you enough for bringing it out today. And we certainly hope to see you again at future uh, finish race Absolutely. car shows. Absolutely, absolutely. Thank you. Th thank you, Jeff.